Really see his little stork bites. Oh, oh, oh. poor thing. Look how funny little stork bites. Big yawn. Big yawn. Hey, puppy. Alright, I have dark circles the size of like freaking Jupiter under my eyes, but. That's just newborns. <laughs> um, but yeah, so today we went to go get his first checkup. And like I expected, I don't know if I mentioned this. I can't remember the last time I picked up the camera and I don't remember what I said. Um, but I, he is looking a little jaundiced to me, a little yellow. Which Riley had a really big issue with. Like she had to be hospitalized and it was a big ordeal. Um, he doesn't look as bad to me as she did. But uh, he called back. I'm sorry. Um... Anyway, um, but they they checked her little levels using like a little stamp thingy on the forehead. I don't really know what that was, but uh, they are a little high. So then they sent us over to get labs done. So we got labs done, and they said it'll take about an hour to get the results back um, to see if, like what the next step will be. Hopefully they'll just send us home with a blanket, and like he doesn't have to be like admitted to the actual hospital to be put under a light. Um, I'm hoping that's the case. <sighs> But yeah, we're gonna go pick up um, Jimmy because his cremated remains are ready. And then we'll see what the doctor says. They said it'll be about an hour before those results are ready. We picked up Jimmy from his thing and his thing's actually really pretty. It's a lot nicer than the one we got my, my dog's cremated too. It's a lot nicer than the one we got for him or for her. Um, it's got that and it's it's like upside down though but it's really pretty i really like the box we kind of it was Dee Dee's was which is my my dog that passed away um her box was just like really plain this one's got like i don't know it just feels nicer it's kind of funny because they put jimmy and then they have little paw prints but obviously he wasn't a dog or a cat so he didn't have paw prints it's kind of funny uh, yeah it's really nice I'm glad we got it. Is he opening his eyes? Oh, I need you, I do. Are you walking me? Oh. Oh. He says, hi, big sissy. Hi, Randy Sky. <laughs> <laughs> How do you bring this me? <laughs> Yeah? 
Oh, I think we're a little bit dramatic. <laughs> no. My baby brother is so cute. Watch out, let me kiss. Oh, okay, gentle, gentle. <laughs> gentle. Watch out for his face. Baby brother. Doing baby brother stuff. <laughs> You're so cute. Now, no, passies are kind of a debated topic um, in breastfed babies. Are, is he taking one at all? We've, but he's found one that he likes, but he he's not too. It's not his dream. Yeah. 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 He was like sometimes he'll take it, and then like, sure. other times he's like, don't even. Yeah. Me. Yeah. This is <laughs> a waste of my time. Why are you doing this? Stuff? <laughs> this but you look good, buddy. So we'll just see what that little number is today. And then hopefully space out the next one to seeing him when he's a month old. Okay. Um, I'll come back in a minute after the nurse is a day in, okay? Baby brother. We love the baby brother. I love the baby brother. <laughs> wow, okay, so this feels so weird. I don't know. I haven't vlogged in like three weeks now, almost three weeks. Um, I just, I feel so bad and I've wanted to vlog so much, but I just like, there's just like a lot of our days pretty monotonous between breastfeeding and him sleeping and just everyday stuff that I just haven't felt like there's much to like actually vlog, but then I'm like, man, I could have just been vlogging clips of him this whole time. And I'm like, oh, I missed those. Like, I, I didn't. <laughs> I didn't record like newborn footage of like Riley when she was like a newborn newborn. So I have more footage of him as a newborn than I ever had of Riley. But still, like, I don't know. <laughs> I feel bad now that he's almost three weeks old. I'm like, wait, what have I been doing? I should have been recording this whole time. Um, I do have clips like here and there and I still haven't even edited. I honestly, I haven't, I've opened my laptop once since we've gotten home since from the hospital. So, I'm very behind on editing anything. I want to edit like a belly progression video eventually. I want to film a birth story one because um, my birth story was kind of crazy. A little crazy. Um, not like too crazy, but there, it was definitely one to like remember. Um, and then I also just have a bunch of clips that I've wanted to throw together. I've tried to make a vlog several times, it just hasn't happened. Um, but yeah, this morning we went to the pediatrician. I think I have a couple of clips of that and before this I tried to record some um, and Basically, we've been going to the pediatrician every week for the past three weeks because of his jaundice now Riley had jaundice too um, But it wasn't that it it was like way worse with her um, and basically what we kind of figured out together, me and this new pediatrician, is that I have like something called breast milk jaundice. Well, he has breast milk jaundice where it's something in my milk, kind of, this happens to some mothers and some people have this with their breast milk. Um, something in the breast milk itself like prohibits them from being able to flush out the bilirubin, um, which explains so much with Riley. Now Riley had troubles nursing too though. But with him, he's nursing like really good. Like my boobs haven't hurt at all. My nipples haven't hurt. Like I don't have any cracking, bleeding. Like I haven't had any issues at all. This has been like my dream idea of nursing, honestly. Aside from the fact that he uses me as a pacifier, but that's a whole nother story. Um, but <laughs> as far as like actually like nursing, like my milk came in right on time. I've got a good supply. Like he's latched on really easily. Like everything's going really smoothly. So I was like, well, what's like the issue here and then I was doing some research online and kind of 
came across there's a difference between breastfeeding jaundice and breast milk jaundice. Breastfeeding jaundice is they're not getting enough breast milk to flush it out. Breastfeed, breast milk jaundice is they're doing everything right, they're making enough wet diapers, they're getting enough, and he is, he's finally gained his birth weight back and everything. Um, he's making enough wet and dirty diapers and everything. It's basically just something in my breast milk, and in some women's breast milk just prohibits, it, it doesn't prohibit, but it works against basically. It doesn't, It there's something in it that doesn't help them <laughs> pass the Billy Rubin out through their stools, so. That's been something we've been dealing with, so he's still quite yellow, but his levels before were at a 16, and now this week they were at an 11, so we're doing better. We're getting past it, um, but yeah, I don't know. There's so much to update on, but then again, there's like not much to update on at the same time. Um, yeah, I want to share some cute clips of him. He's currently taking a nap. I'm trying to get him to stop just sleeping in my arms and I'm trying to get him to actually sleep in his crib because um, that's it's more like he wants to just sit there on the boob and just kind of have it in his mouth and suck on it here and there um, while he's sleeping which obviously doesn't work for me because I can get nothing done um, but yeah Hi hey, baby brother Why do you always look so angry? <laughs> this is how we're doing bath time tonight Riley there, he's here. He's probably gonna have some booby here in a minute. Look at that angry face. Why do you look so angry? Oh, he's like, leave me alone. I think he's ready for a boob, actually. <laughs> oh, we manage. We manage, huh? We're figuring out, we're figuring out what, how we're gonna do stuff. Every day it's different. All right, so we got baby brother breastfeeding. <laughs> And I just do have to say, while we're here, that little Riley Sky has been the best big sister in the entire world. She has adapted to being a big sister so well. It's like, it's unbelievable, honestly. Like, she doesn't get upset when he cries. She's had to split her attention a lot, and she's very, very, very understanding. Way more understanding than I expected her little three-year-old self to be. Cause she's very much a princess but when it comes to her baby brother she's very understanding and i am just so proud of her even though you are a time sucker you just let everything the way you want it when you want it right then and there and she's just amazing she's the best big sister ever huh are you a good big sister yeah yeah you love your baby brother yeah, I know you do.